Psalms 136.16 To him which led his people through the wilderness, for his mercy endureth forever. The 40 years in the desert after the exodus from Egypt is an event that the people of Israel cannot forget when describing God's great miracles. First, they came to the shores of the Red Sea. When Pharaoh changed his mind about letting the people go, he followed them with his army when they reached the Red Sea. The enslaved people had to come near the Red Sea in order to be mentally and militarily prepared to face the armies of powerful local kings in the land of Canaan where they were to go next. But God opened a way through the middle of the Red Sea and brought the people to the other side instead of handing them over to Pharaoh's army that came after them to take them away. Attempting to do so, the Egyptian army drowned in the Red Sea and perished. Although God's primary plan was to enable the people who arrived across the sea to face the conditions in the land of Canaan and lead them there, the whole generation who disbelieved in God after hearing the frightening description given by those who came to spy on the land of Canaan had to travel through the desert for 40 years and give way to their next generation. Here again, we see God's extraordinary providence. One natural disaster was enough to wipe out this people. All could have been lost in the harsh conditions of the desert. Diseases could kill the entire population. Starvation could occur without access to water and food. Those left alone in the wilderness could be destroyed by organized bandits or armies. But apart from that, the God who has protected us whenever such challenges have arisen will lead us triumphantly in this worldly life for eternity. God bless you.